Welcome to today's Ips and Daisy video. Today I'm going to be doing my review of 2019. Um, I've decided to go back to something that I did a couple of years ago, which was to do a white on black review. It was really striking. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do something re recreate that style again. Um, basically, I'm gonna be popping it into my um, new citrus book bindery journal. Um, these pages are A5 um, and the black paper that I'm going to be adding um, is also A5. I am going to just trim it down ever so slightly just so that I've got a little border um, around and it's not kind of sticking out when I stick it in. Um, so in order to do that, I'll we'll start off with the pages first of all. Um, I'm just going to mark and take an edge off and I'm using um, my Sakura Jelly Roll pens in order to draw the whole thing basically but to make marks on the paper so that it stands out so taking off kind of maybe half to three quarters of a centimeter And it's a double page spread and I want it to be identical on both sides so I'm just going to measure it up there. Just so that I'm taking the same amount off of both. And then I'm going to take the same amount off of the side of the page. Actually, I want to take a little bit less off of the side. Just so that it's an even border and then meets in the middle. The reason I draw a line is because I can't cut straight, so it's easier for me to draw a line to follow. I'm going to try and freehand trim a bit an edge off. That's my two pages ready to go. Move all of this out of the way. Um, and how I'm going to lay it out. So I'm turning it over so that I've got the bits where I haven't drawn lines. This is my double page spread. And the first thing I'm going to do is pop the year in the middle. Um, so I'm going to do the 201 side and the 19 the other side. I'm just kind of eyeballing it really. Let me zoom in so that you can see a bit more closely what I'm doing. So that's the kind of basis to the spread and everything's gonna go around it. I am gonna add some detail in these letters um, and what I did last year was basically just doodle in them um, because it adds it looks really nice just kind of the white on black doodling so I'll probably add some music and speed this up
Okay, so that's the center of my spread. I quite like that kind of doodles in the, the white and black. I think it's really effective. I don't know if you can just about see um, the detail of it there. I'll try and close in a little bit more. That's as zoomed in as I can get. Um, but yeah, it really stands out on the paper. Um, so now I'm gonna add in all of my um, kind of stats to remember. I'm gonna start off with social media. Um, and hopefully that side has dried perfectly now. Um, so I may do this in a little strip down the edge of the page. Keep it separate. Um, I'm just gonna do a little dotted line. And other than having um, the date in the center um, and the social media down one side, I haven't really got a plan for this page. So I am gonna just add things around um, the sides of the 2019. Um, but let's do the social media bits first. So Facebook can go there. And this is all for, for Oops a Daisy, so oh, maybe I should put that. So I need Facebook, Insta, uh, Pinterest, YouTube, newsletter. Now, you'll see what I'm gonna do here is slightly alternate. I'm not gonna do them in order because I find with the white gel pens, you have to let them dry, otherwise you risk smudging them. I've said that out loud and I probably still will smudge them. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna do what I can to let it dry in between. So I'm gonna do the newsletter and the Facebook and then I'm gonna leave it. Um, to dry before I do the, the in-betweeny ones. Okay. I'm gonna put a little banner across one side of the page. I'm done. I need to think of something I can put up here. Um, maybe just a little daisy doodle. Okay, 
So that is my year in review spread. I'm going to add it into my journal now um, and then I will double check the stats on the side. Basically, it's just a whole load of memories from the year. I did have to go through my phone and my journals to remember different things and I'll probably continue to add to it. Um, but I think it looks really effective. So to add it into my journal, I'm going to use some um, roller tape. Um, and then I'm just going to put that on the back and pop it into my new citrus journal. So let's find the pages where it's supposed to go. Even with the trimming, I can see that I still need to trim it down a little bit. Um, I am going to just tuck it right into the gap. So that is it. My um, 2019 review spread. Um, I love how it's turned now. I need to add in these stats down the side, but I think the, the white on the black is really powerful. I'm going to give you a little close up there. Um, yeah, I really, really love it. Um, probably my favourite spread in the journal so far. Um, I will take some closer shots and I'll add all the details in. Um, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe and also the little bell icon. Um, just means that you'll be notified when new videos go up from us. Um, as always, thanks for all of your support this year. I should have added that into the spread. Um, some love for you guys for, for watching and supporting me. Um, it doesn't go unnoticed and it is very, very much appreciated. Um, so yeah, if you can get, click subscribe, more videos coming soon. Take care.